And we're back. Um, we have made a decision here. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait, wait, I think it's six. I think I overcounted. Sorry, I'm sleepy. Um, anyway, we've, we've come to a conclusion that I'm not going to win this. <laughs> I ain't winning this mission. Nice job. I'm not winning this mission. Um, so we're gonna very, very slowly start to pull. We're gonna start, we're gonna start pulling our soldiers back. And we're still gonna start getting them out of here. Cause I, I cannot think straight, you guys. I, I, I do not, I do not have this. And the fact that there's two outsiders right fucking there. Um, oh, I should not have done that. Okay. The fact that there's two outsiders there. Um, actually, I might be able to... Weren't there aliens here last time? And I can't think straight. I can't play right. You know, I think it's best if I call this a wash and just be like, hey... Hey, dog. Hey, we don't know. We might be able to, might be able to accomplish a little something right there. That looks like it might be, that might be worth investigating more. So, all right, we'll 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 keep trying to win this, and um, I'll keep up with the real talk. You know, I I could have just played Fallout 4 because I have that and instead of just doing this, but I wanted to do this because I hadn't recorded in the hot hot a hot second I hadn't recorded in a minute so I usually try and stack up a bunch of episodes so I can just release them but I hadn't been able to do that recently because I've been, just been tired when I come home from work but um, I could be playing Fallout 4 and one of the big praises I have for that game and I didn't think I'd like Fallout 4 that much because me I can't guys I can't I don't do open games well or open world games well I should say um, the reason for that is and there's a there's a very very good reason for my lack of of enjoying open world games. It's because games like 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 Bethesda games in general. I won't I don't want to use the word intimidating because that's not the proper word I'm looking for. But the, but what it is is the way I play games is I always have a set goal in mind. Like there's always something I want to accomplish in a video game. So when you put in front of me like a huge wide open game with no kind of fuck. Um, with no kind of like, a, there's a goal in those Bethesda games. Sure, there's something you're supposed to accomplish, somebody you're supposed to beat, or something like that. But how you do it is entirely up to you. And uh, you know, a lot of a lot of people like that sort of freedom. Like, oh yeah, this is great. You know, me, hell no, I don't like that sort of freedom. I like my games rigid and structured. Fuck, I should not have done. Uh, oh no, but no, I should have done that because Lakota can save her. Because Lakota's a fucking G, doesn't give a shit, and he'll kill everybody in front of his goddamn path if he has to. He'll leave the whole block filled with lead. You know why? Because he just don't give a fuck. Um, where was I saying? Oh yeah, but open world games just kind of it, it it gets me lost. And I know some people are like, yeah, that's the point of the open world game. Me, no, I like objectives and goals. I like hey. Here, here's what this game is about. This is what you have to do. This is how you do it. You better go get that done. That's what I like. All right. That's that's my, that's my thing. That's my shit. You know. Um. Yo, man, you ain't gonna hit this, but we gonna try it too anyway. Yeah, I saw that coming. Um. That's why, uh, like. I feel like they throw too much bullshit at you in open world games, you know? Like, it's just, it's all way too fucking much. Like, damn it, I can't use items. Um, like, it's, it's, it's too much, honestly. Like, here, here's a good experiment. Here's a good experiment. Um, I'm a fan of, I'm a fan of Assassin's Creed. And I know, I know that just, I, I know that's just gonna get some people just, fucking in a twist. It's a guilty pleasure game. I can't help it. Dynasty Warriors is right up there. 
um, or Samurai Warriors or any of the Warriors games are, is right up there um, with my guilty, 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 guilty pleasure. Um, what, uh, and as much as I like the Assassin's Creed games because they're so rigid and unchanged, and I know a lot of people hate that shit, but not me. I'm like, yeah, cool. Bring on more. <laughs> um, and they keep making those games because assholes like me keep buying it. But what I want you to do is if you have a game by Ubisoft, whether it be Assassin's Creed, Far Cry 4, or whatever other fucking game they put out there that's like supposed to be super serial, you know, Watch Dogs, which is a famous terrible. No, actually, no, don't don't play Watch Dogs. Don't give into that. Um, <laughs> um, I want you to load up whatever Ubisoft game you have, whether it be Watch Dogs or something else. And I want you to uh, just go to the map. Don't worry, I'll wait. See all those those fucking icons on that screen there? That's what I hate. I hate that shit. I hate that there's like there's just so much shit that they just shove into it. Like they just took a shotgun full of objectives and activities and then they just pulled the trigger. I I cannot cannot stand that shit. And as much as I like playing Assassin's Creed sometimes and, and doing some Assassin's Creed shit all that shoot this motherfucker tomorrow that's what I'm talking about we got this mission back baby um as much as I like that shit like I always feel like uh, there's always an objective in Assassin's Creed I want to go to like I see there a story objective or maybe some sort of mission some sort of side mission one of the side the small small kitchen size sample of side missions that I enjoy and I want to go do that and then there's all this other fucking shit like you gotta collect this you gotta you gotta collect that you gotta do this for this person. I'm just like, man, just no. And I know it's all optional, and more. There's nothing wrong with having more content for games, but fuck, man, like, That's affirmative. there's a limit. And Reloaded. one of the big things that I hate, and I argue with a friend with this all the time, Reloaded. about um about this when it comes to Bethesda games, is like the world just does not give a fuck about your character, like at all. Like, you can do a whole lot of things, and the most that you might get out of it is someone might go, hey, you're, you're, we'll make like an off-the-cuff remark, like, hey, you're that guy that did the thing that one time. Whatever. Like, the, the big thing that made me, re like, hate Skyrim, and, and, yeah, that's right, I said hate. Hate, as in loathe, not, did not like, was hate Skyrim is, I, like, when you become, like, leader of the Assassin's Guild, or Thieves Guild, or whatever the fuck it's called. What was that sound? Um, when you become the leader, nothing about the world changes. Nobody treats you differently. I mean, yeah, like I said, they might make like remarks like, "Oh, look, it's the fucking king of all assholes," but truly, they're just like, "Eh." You don't you don't change the world at all. Whereas a more structured game, you can do that sort of thing. You can't move. Um, where you can do that sort of thing, where uh, they will treat you differently depending on what you've done. You know? That shit's cool to me. Like, uh, uh, and this is going to be sort of a bad example to to pull out because of the, and I want to say unjustified hate that this game gets. Look at Mass Effect. Sure, it takes an entire game for that to, to change, but the things, your actions have consequences. You know, actually, Mass Effect is a bad example because that's super structured, not open world at all. But I mean, man, I can't think of a real game, a, a game right now. I'm, like I said, my brain is like, my brain is taking a colossal fart, <laughs> and and these these kind of stray thoughts are like the result of that colossal fart. No, I'm not even gonna, not even gonna do it. Oh god, I love this song. Sorry, like I said, the brain is everywhere. Mm, 
it's just not going too well for you. No, don't risk it. Stay right there. That's right, Lakota. You keep busting them fucking shots, bro. Um, but yeah, it's just like your actions have no consequence. It's just you. Nothing about the game changes besides you get like maybe an achievement, and maybe like, like I said, like some sort of slash slap dash remark, like oh yeah, this guy that did, that did the thing. But you know the world just carries on without you. And maybe that's what some people like. They like to just get lost in the world. They like to be not that super important guy, even though you're a super important guy in every fucking Fallout. Um, you're just you're just the dude. You know you're nobody special. No one gives a fuck about you. Um, and keep suppressing him. I want him staying right there. Um, yeah, I like my games like rigid and terribly and, and structured. Like game start. Here is goal. This is what you do to get towards goal. Go achieve goal. Uh, you know what? I equate it to World of Warcraft. Now, that is about as well, not as about as open world, but it's close to open world as you're gonna get without it being truly just open box like Star Wars Galaxy styles, where you just do whatever the fuck you want. But at that trade off is that nothing you do really matters. Um, there's a bunch of different ways to play Warcraft. I should know. I played that game for far too long. We're not gonna reveal how long I played that game, because um, quite frankly, it's a <laughs> it was a really long time. Whatever, fuck it. I enjoyed it. I made a ton of fucking friends off of that. Really? Um. But uh. Yeah. Oh, he's on Overwatch. Oh, you clever bastard! You almost had me running in there like a dick. You almost had me running in there. Um. I wonder if I could get like aim sight on like one of them with this, with this guy. But I made a lot of friends in Warcraft, and there's a ton of different ways to play Warcraft. Especially now, you can do raiding, which was my whole big shebang. You can just do this bullshit, you can do pet fights, you can do basically whatever you want. But even as open as Worldcraft Worldcraft Warcraft was, I always played the game with an, with a set goal in mind. Like I was gonna get this item or kill this boss or do this dungeon or, or do do whatever. I had a set goal in mind. Uh, whether it was like a long-term goal or a short-term goal, it was something I was gonna do. And that's how I like my games, where there's something that I want to do, and I was gonna do it one way or another. Um, but when a game just basically just plops the whole world in front of me and says, "All right, do you?" I'm just like, well, "Fuck, what do I do?" And then I start to lose interest in it because there's just so fucking much for me to do. There's just so much possible, and then. Eventually, I just get bored, and then I'm like, yeah, I'm not doing this anymore. I don't know what changed in New Vegas. Well, maybe because New Vegas was done by a city, and the New Vegas is awesome. Um, and there was actual shit, and the world can actually change to your actions. That's what I was looking for. And then Skyrim came out, and everybody fucking came buckets over that. And I was just like, oh, yeah, this is it? Okay. Plus, it's full of bugs. You know, shit. And they were like, the dragon fights were amazing, and they were just average at best. Don't shoot at him. Right. Fuck nugget. Dick with wheels. Oh, I didn't mean to shoot. I'll take that, though. I'll take that. Can you fucking finish this guy, Lakota? Motherfucking Lakota Fisher. Where'd that other asshole go? Cause he's there. I know he's there. We're gonna keep people on Overwatch, cause I know he's. I know he's there. Oh, he's in that room. So we're gonna try and sneak up behind him. Um, I think I might win this mission, you guys. I think I might have turned a bad thing into a a sort of decent. You guys can't tell right now, or maybe you can just by the sound of my voice, but yes, I'm copy. basically playing this with my eyes half closed. 
this is not gonna be funny at all. Like this, this, Moving. this particular video is not gonna be funny. But we're, it doesn't. Not every video has to be funny, you know. I'm not on here forcing myself to be funny. Like I just, <sighs> basically how I do it, and I know nobody cares. For the five of you watching this, basically how I've been doing this is just like I've just been basically turning the game on and then hitting record and just saying the first thing that comes to mind whether it turns out to be just absolutely goddamn hilarious or just kind of insightful or whatever that's how I've been doing it you know and that's how I'm gonna do it probably oh fuck I didn't mean to do that oh well um man I'm so paranoid to go in there dude because I don't want him I know he's there and I know he's on overwatch and I know he's gonna he's got some oh I found you now you dick hole Oh fuck, Damar was not playing. Another one down. Oh snap! Oh snap! You guys, I did it! With only one guy lost, and I thought I was gonna I thought I know a bunch of them are gonna be injured, but fuck, I did it. Yay! You goddamn right Lakota gets fucking promoted. And and Moreno gets promoted. Hmm. Oh, we lost Vera Wadi. Whatever, she'll be fine. She alright, she'll be fine. Everybody else lived. We defeated a medium sized UFO guys. We're I'm um, I'm starting to I'm starting to feel it, but that was hard, man. Like they just all just they came with the thunder. And I you know what? That was my goal when playing this game. I wanted you guys to see me um in just hmm. I like hollow targeting more. It's more useful. Um, but that's what I wanted you guys to see. I wanted you to see. It's like Left 4 Dead. You know? How Left 4 Dead is not fun until shit goes horribly wrong. Well, I'll take that back. Left 4 Dead is fun on its own. But Left 4 Dead is at its best when things are horribly, horribly fucking wrong. Like, <laughs> like... Like a, a tank to spawn next to a witch, and one of your friends is down, and and another one is is hanging off like the rooftops, and and then you just you just get that fuck it in your system. You're like fuck it, I'm gonna I'm gonna run, and you know, <laughs> and you just book it for the door, and you're like maybe I can make this. That's what Left 4 Dead is at its best, man. I have a lot of good Left 4 Dead memories. Um, oh man, but I totally got so far away from my point about Fallout. Point about Fallout is. As immensely if I've enjoyed that game, the best thing about that game, and I feel like this is stupid, I don't have to, god damn it, I don't have any interceptors, you dick. Um, the, the best thing about that is they didn't do what a lot of games do these days, and that's, um, that's, um, here's our game being made, you know, and here's the DLC that's coming. Like, your game's not even out yet, and you already got, like, additional shit planned. That just seems like hustling to me. Like, you're you're putting out a product, and you're only putting out, like, maybe two-thirds of the product, or half the product. Commander, you we've just black one of our motherfucker! We will now be unable to track any UFO contacts over that particular nation, and they've cut our funding as a result. I'm so fucking Now I have to waste not I have to waste a satellite on my home country and they brought this their panic up because these dicks destroyed a satellite and now I can't tell what's happening in my own goddamn country and I got nine to oh god oh my god I'm so fucking mad anyway cuz I was reading about Street Fighter today cuz I used to get down on Street Fighter and yeah fuck it man UK you can have that Go for it. Um, I was reading about Street Fighter and they had some talk and dude was like, Yeah man, we already got our second wave of DLC planned out and I'm just like, Alright, this is unfucking believable. This is un how how do you have <laughs> how do you how is your game not even out yet, not even close to being out, and you already have two ways of DLC. 
What happened to fucking unlockables? What happened to just putting that shit in the game? Like, this is how you unlock that shit. Now it's just like, nope. I mean, I, it'd be cool if you can just un... Mm, I'm sorry, Argentina, not now. Um, how is it that we're going to save our game even though our satellite got destroyed, but whatever, because we survived that mission and that was a, that was a big thing for me, you know? That was, that was a huge thing. Let's see if I can get some money. Um, but you're just like... I can understand if you have some unlockables in your game, and some games do this. Um, it's like, hey, um, you can unlock it the hard way, or you can just pay us some dollars and just skip all that. You know, here they're going to have like, oh man, yeah, our game's coming. It's not even here yet. We got plenty of time to put all this shit on disc, but we're not going to do that. You just have to buy it later. You're, you're putting out like 50% of a product at this point. I'm going to say 50% on them because, you know, that's 50%. Because they're just cutting out a bunch of goddamn characters and some bullshit just so they can make money off it later. Ubisoft has become the toy. Ubisoft has become worse than EA than that shit. Oh boy! Commander, we picked up multiple requests for assistance. Abductions in progress are marked on the hollow globe. So this is a good time to stop because I'm I'm sleepy and it is now... Whoops, 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 whoops. Oh, it's, it's midnight exactly. Um, so yeah, next time, we're going to fucking Russia. Because uh, Vladimir Putin didn't secure his fucking borders and has just let aliens all in his shit. So we'll take care of that. Who do I have that can take care of that shit? Who just came back from duty? Uh, and nope is there. Oh, nope's going. I know that's for sure. Jay Reed. Oh, I can go. I'll go. What about my dad? Can he go? Nah, he's still tired. He got a couple hours. He's still tired, though. I might just boost him up. But yeah. Um. Yeah, I think I'm done with sleepy times. I swear, I, I promise next time it'll be all about the game. You know? And, uh. I won't be so sleepy. And uh, always glad to have more help down here. You're welcome, Dr. Shen. Why don't you build me a goddamn satellite? Maybe not talk so fuck. That's what I get for being an asshole. Um anyway, yeah. I'm I'm gonna pause this and I'm gonna take a shower and go to sleep and it's gonna be fucking magical. Um you guys should do the same thing. You should take a shower and go to sleep and be fucking magical. And I'll uh and why and when you while you do that, I'll see you guys later. Have a good one. It's night night time.